Hey y'all, don't forget to hit these buttons over here while you're listening. First up, Elon Musk inaccurate post to his 200 million followers are raising concerns about his potential to manipulate public trust before the U.S. election day. He also made the statement, no one is even trying to Biden and Kamala, um, which the Secret Service has said they are aware. They are aware. Apparently an increase on tariffs on imported goods, particularly from China, has a, a narrow support from the majority of U.S. voters. Uh, I'm going to try to say it right. Reuters and IPSOS poll shows. Whoever they're asking, I'm not sure. Um, that's what, you know, he wants to use that to pay for child care. I think I had already reported that they were putting this on hold. It was a go. And then they came back and said, hold on, hold on. Um, as far as legally betting on elections. They're now saying uh, it would threaten confidence in voting and should be banned. It's already entertainment. And it shouldn't be. Election officials were sent suspicious packages in at least five states. We had Nebraska, Tennessee, Wyoming, Oklahoma, and Iowa. Most packages were determined to be harmless. Oklahoma officials identified flour in their package. An Ohio sheriff has asked residents to write down Harris supporter addresses so that he could send illegal immigrants to the supporters. Quick question. I saw a creator say this. So I am in a state that it's going to be, we already, it's going to be red. It's going to be. There's no way it's not. And so if you're not in a swing state, right? Shouldn't I not, I'm not, I don't want to do what I did in 2016 and just go with the other guy. I don't like the other guy and I'm not in the same place I was eight years ago. I do am armed with more facts. I do ha have more information. Um, I don't know if I'll be allowed a third choice, but I really want to vote for Claudia de la Cruz. And if I'm in a state where it's already decided, shouldn't I go with, that candidate that I want so that it shows up in those numbers, what, even though they're small, let me know. Okay, I have more slides, sorry. Ohio has also received at least 33 BOMB threats, which is causing a daily sweep at Springfield schools. All have determined to be hoaxes. Um, However, they're still needing, um, obviously, you've got to check. You have to, right? Springfield also canceled its Culture Fest, citing safety concerns due to threats. Nearly 40 million people could die from antibiotic-resistant superbug infections by 2050, a new study estimates. A Disney trip meant for homeless students went to New York City school employees' kids. Six employees of New York City's public school system misused tickets meant for homeless students to take their own, own children on trips to Disney World and New Orleans. And I just want to pause to say that this is where capital, because, oh, it was so wrong. But when you have a system set up, I don't, I don't get, I would not take away from the homeless children. That's not what I mean. I genuinely try to step in, right? And it's not like, these people shouldn't be pitted against each other, but they have been. So this lady, who probably didn't make great money, right? But not homeless. Probably lower middle class working for the public school system. I could be wrong. I could look this up and she could have means. But my point here is this system. Okay. Okay. A New York woman is challenging Miss America, Miss World rules that ban mothers from participating in the beauty pageants. They say um, it creates an outdated stereotype about women not being able to balance motherhood and success. I reposted a creator um, who reported on this. We learned yesterday about Amber Nicole Thurman, who 28 passed away during emergency surgery in August of 2022 because 
They waited too long. It could have been prevented. So, ugh. don't forget to hit those buttons over there. I hope your day doesn't suck. Okay, love y'all. Bye.